Please welcome Jay and Mark Duplass. Mark, Jay, uh, uh, now, Jay, you're the older brother, right? I am. Now, um, was working together, uh, like, both of yours idea, or did your mom say, you have to let your brother play with you <laughs> when you were younger? Because he loves you so much. It's a great question. It's a yeah, really great it question. Is. It is. There was a little bit of onus that our parents put on us playing together, working together. They were a little bit nefarious. They would punish us and sort of, like, get us to the point where we would rebel against the greater forces of our parents and work together in, in various ways. So you guys bonded through the oppression of your parents. Absolutely. Absolutely. It was man. a damn cold war in a house. Yeah. Uh, the, the, the show is t Togetherness. What does that name mean for the show? Because the people on the show aren't together that much. They're... They're, they, they have trouble with their feelings. They're together-ish more than they're together <laughs> yes, they're together what, what does that title mean for you guys? Yeah, there's a little bit of a, a double meaning with togetherness in that, you know, Mark and I are family guys. Yeah. We're close with our friends. We're close with our parents. We have young children. Mm -hmm. And we do our best to stay together and to work together. Uh, but you get to that point after about a week or so where you're doing everything together where you're just like, get me out of here. I don't like these people anymore. And there's a little bit of a tortured element to togetherness, the concept. And it's a lot about, I mean, how Jay and I are. We've been working together since we were kids, and, and we always feel like what we do is it's difficult. Our television show is like this large monster that is threatening to destroy us at every turn, and we feel like we have strength in numbers and we need to stay together to sort of, like, defeat the Frankenstein. Yeah, your, your brothers help you with this show, right? Yeah. Because you don't want to die. Yeah. <laughs> You, you know that you're... I don't, I don't want to die, Jay. <laughs> but, but you are aware but you that your, your show is going to kill you. They're all lawyers. <laughs> okay, they that, can help that can me help. sue someone. So wait, you're, you, they, they're not helping? I'm the only one in my family that's in entertainment. Oh, okay. Yeah. All right. All right, he's going to die. I guess you'll be... I guess you'll... <laughs> you're probably probably going to be okay. Yeah. yeah. Because you brothers, is there like sort of a, sort of a semi-secret like twin language that you use? Like... That, a, like a code you have that other people don't yeah, understand? Yeah, I mean, it's, you know, we have to be able to, in, a, in any given situation, because we're directing together, say something about someone and have them not really know what's happening, you know? Um, that's, so that's true. It's, it can be helpful. To I mean, have some code, like, we could just we a could, little something. We could talk a little bit. Try, yeah. so sure. Would you like to? We could have a little interaction. Give me a little plus code. Maybe figure out. I'll try like, to. If we're, if we're sitting here on a talk show and it's just going really poorly, for instance. Yeah. Let's yeah. just say that was happening, yeah. you know? Yeah. And we felt our host... Well, the host we, is not pulling his weight. He's not pulling okay, his weight. Let's just it, you know? um, I would say something like, dude, this, this dude's cream cheesing up on this all over the place. Yeah, I'd say white van? White van. Definitely white van. White van. White van. I don't know... <laughs> And I you don't know the, what cream cheese means. You get but the gist. I don't though. know. I do. I don't understand <laughs> what cream cheese means. White van sounds like you're going to murder me and... That's it! That's and it. put me in a That's white it. van That's and drive it. me away. That's close. Yeah. The, the etymology is pretty simple. Um, our grandmother, whenever she didn't have anything uh, for the recipe, if it called for something white, she would just put cream cheese in it. Because yeah. like, she just Like for potatoes? Really, yeah, just like, yeah. I don't Rice, have those. Let's sugar? Just, let's put the cream cheese in it. So that's now our family terminology for someone who doesn't quite know what they're doing, but tries mm -hmm. to make it happen anyway. And, uh... <laughs> And also, we, we were really sweet and sensitive as 13-year-old kids, uh, basically treating our grandmother, who grew up in abject poverty, with, like, is there cream cheese in is there? Is there cream cheese in this? Yeah. <laughs> the woman who was, like, scared to buy anything at a grocery store. Well, where's White Van come White from? White Van, our father is a lawyer, and he had a private detective who would often talk about all these nefarious things that he would do with the White Van. And there was this suggestion at a certain point that if someone was acting really inappropriately, that maybe he would have to take him away in a white van. <laughs> See, that's... Forget my brothers. That's who I want helping me with my show. <laughs> Absolutely. Absolutely.